But also with that, Dr. Lisa Su promising that a mainstream GPU should be coming out before the end of the quarter, okay? So we should get that, saying that they're on track to expand their RDNA 3 GPU portfolio with the launch of new mainstream Radeon 7000 series GPUs this quarter. This goes in line with the fact that we're hearing that AMD should be announcing the RX 7600 XT right around Computex time. Maybe we might get a 7700, 7800 XT by the time June ends. It's not quite clear what their strategy is with that, but there was a new Rock'em post that came out, which indicates that AMD has more GPUs up their sleeves. So this looks to be the full lineup of what AMD is launching. They posted this, they quickly retracted it, but people obviously got those details out before AMD could take them down. 7500 XT, 7600 XT, 7700 XT, 7800 XT. But the most important one, the top tier bad boys, the 7950 XT and the 7950 XTX look like they should be hitting stores at some point. Now, this is not quite clear if it's gonna be similar to what AMD did with the RX 6000 series, which made it so that the 50 series only had an increase in VRAM speed, which might work may not in order to get it up to the 4090 level, but it could potentially have some GPU core increases. We'll have to wait and see what AMD actually has, but the 7950 XTX is real. We don't know when it'll be hitting, hopefully sometime soon. I just, I want, if they could give it to us for like 1200 bucks and it beats the 4090, that'd be great. I'd love to see it. Or they just replace the 7900 XTX at a thousand dollars with the 7950 XTX and it beats the 4090. I would love to see that too. Additionally, we did get some leaked benchmarks of a 7800 XT in Geekbench, but don't trust these as far as that we can see that this is either number one fake or number two, uh, a very early pre-production unit because the 7800 XT barely ties the 6700 XT. So if you see these numbers floating out on the internet, maybe just take them with a massive grain of salt and take me with water? Would take me with a capybara or something. I don't know. This episode of Hot News is over. I'll see you back here for more of the hottest tech news to close out your week tomorrow.